back to my channel. Here's Sarah. Hi, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like every time when Sarah is here, we are doing unboxing. So uh, sometimes seems that way. Seems, seems that, that way. way. But you know what? Next time we want her to come back to do some comparison. Yeah. But here is all about unboxing. And before we start, I need to let you guys know. I have no clue. So she says she doesn't have a box. So I don't have a box. I don't have a box. And the item is from Italy or all the way fly from Italy. Okay, there's always a story. I guess I feel like there's always a story of each item. Yeah. I don't want to say a bag or shoes or what, but same with this as well. Uh, I don't want to say I was eyeing this bag a few months ago or two, three months oh, ago. Oh, so it is a bag. It is a bag, right. <laughs> okay. I don't want to, well, I wasn't eyeing, but I did some review. I mean, kind of check on the uh, the review. And I think the more I see it, the more grow on me. So I really want it. Okay. But so. I don't want to pay the retail price. So I've been kind of looking for if there's any... Mm, discount or if there's anything but anyhow so finally i got it okay so is this a brand new item it is a brand new item. okay it's a brand new item but you got it in europe i got it in europe and from one of the website okay alrighty. so we will let you know where she got it from right because i have the receipt but now i think you guys wait long enough okay oh I think I probably know what it is because she probably mentioned it to me before. I, it's definitely not a classic bag. Okay. And it may be more of the trendy bag and it may go out of fashion. But anyhow. So if you like to see this type of video, please give it a like. So we will bring you lots of more unboxing in the near future. And if you haven't subscribed my channel, my name is Amy. This is my sister, Sarah. Please hit that red subscribe button and ring my bell. So uh, joining my YouTube family really made my All day. Right. So I guess so enough saying it. You guys probably thinking what bag am I getting or I got. All right. So we're going to. All right. And I, this is how exactly I got it from the box. I have already removed the box the uh, receipt this is the receipt all right okay that's the receipt right. all right so okay it come with the ribbon okay so now i need to remove the ribbon i want you to guess what i'm got what it, i'm what guessing is that the bottega bag that you've been talking about <laughs> i think i probably right because right. that's the bag that I did not approve of. But we'll find out. Right. Maybe I like right. it when I see it in I person. guess it's not everything I do I need to get approval <laughs> from Amy. But of course, with her blessing or approval, that would be even better. All right. I sounded like her mother, not her right, sister. But anyway, all righty. Uh, oh, it is? Okay. We'll take a... All right. It is a Bottega right. bag. It's kind of... Yeah, let me remove... All right. So... So we need to see that moment when she take it out from the from the dust bag. Alrighty, I slowly remove it for you. Oh, da da! This is the new bag. With this this is, is the cassette with the chin. Well, oh, some wow. people say it's more like a pillow bag. It is, but to be honest with you, remember? What's your first impression? <laughs> remember 30 what's, seconds ago, I said I did not approve of this handbag. What's your first impression, sis? My first impression is not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Seriously. <laughs> because, first of all, I need to say the reason I say not bad is because it's in like a light brown. Like this is called beige, beige or almond color. Almond color. That's what they call almond okay, color. Okay, I truly love this color because I did not like the green and the pink, the red. I didn't. I although red is my 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 uh pink and red is my favorite color, but I really think this style, this color is not bad at all. And I do not have any back in this color so that's another reason actually i like the green they have a two different green one it's a darker green one it's a lighter green but i figure i already have the green bag the trendy bag from chanel and the ms um whatever the evelyn the evelyn yes. yes so you know what seriously not bad okay because 
the real thing when you see it what leather is this this is a lamb skin lambs oh wow this lamb skin is different than chanel lamb skin i don't know if you guys can see it because this lamb skin because it's a puffy it's like a puff you know like really puffy like a pillow it's Pil like a like pillow. pillow we're gonna give you like you know and we're gonna give you a masha and we will also give you the weight of this handbag in a minute and we probably can do a what's in what's how how much can fit in I this guess handbag? the only really thing, if there's a pros and a cons, I think the cons is the chain. It's, it, it's, it's pretty very, heavy. Very, it's pretty heavy. Very, very right. heavy. But with the top handle here, so I guess you can carry it. And you cannot like this. even remove the handle. You right, can't it's not. But you know what? Like I mentioned, I don't want to pay the retail price. The retail price here in stay is $39.80. And of course, after plus tax, it's probably it's about forty-two or forty-three hundred dollar U.S. dollar. So I've been kind of just browsing, browsing, and looking for where I can get it. So I got it from this the European website. It's uh, Duomo. It's du called Duomo, Duomo, right? Right. Let me hold you. Duomo. So right. yeah. Wow. And I got it, and then uh, the price they have it's. Uh, I guess it's two thousand six hundred twenty two ninety five euro. Euro, euro. euro. Yes. But and because I'm a new customer, so they give me a fifteen ten or fifteen percent off. So after the discount it's the European is twenty two hundred twenty nine dollar and fifty one cents. And we'll put it then plus of course I have to pay the duty free. Oh, you so do? Okay. total all together come up to a little bit over thirty one hundred US dollar. Okay. So I figure I'm getting quite a substantial saving. I mean to tell you the fact, forty two hundred US dollar I don't think I would have buy it i mean because this is again this is not a classic bag this is more of the trendy bag i mean i really like it but i don't i just don't see myself i want to spend over forty two hundred dollar yeah. but if i can get it this the authentic bag from europe and for the price thirty one hundred dollar i can i think it's good yeah it is and let's open it how sure. you open this all bag? right this bag okay you need to open it you need to kind of push up and okay let me and I, I can see this is one of the con now right yeah oh alrighty my oh my god that's a struggle <laughs> <laughs> that's a struggle let's see okay especially if you have nails you know right, that you is don't... a struggle so yeah okay oh, finally, I open, finally, finally, finally I open it okay so here, and then let's remove the, the tissue paper. So this inside is the bag. has a back pocket right, and has a, a lipstick holder. Right. Yeah, lipstick holder and back pocket. Right. And oh, have syrup. Oh no, this no, is no, not. No, no, that's that's yeah. because that's how you okay, intertwine the, the, okay. the leather. So I'm gonna go get my scale so we can weight this handbag so you guys know. But I figure I don't have any of this color and I want to get one. And then join my collection, my handbag <laughs> paradise. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretty soon she's going to round out the, the cubby hole like the one in the back. So right, she probably needs so to, let's all right, see. so let's weight this handbag. Oh my God, this is super heavy, I think, I would think. All right, so two pounds and 10 ounces. We just put it on the scale. So let's say if you put stuff there, it probably like a four pound or so. Four or five pounds, depend upon. I mean, the bag, I would say it's about medium size. And um, you probably cannot put a whole lot, but good enough. Okay, so we're going to start with what's in, uh, how much can fit in this handbag. We're going to try to put in the old case and Chanel uh, car, key. car key holder and uh, hand, cream. hand cream, pen, lipstick, and key, and sunny, and uh, that's pretty much you can put in it, this uh, full size wallet, yeah. And maybe you can still put in a 
card holder, your key, your cam queen. Maybe not. Pen and key. Key is important. In Texas, we need key. Car key to go out. And sun and lipstick and sunny. All right. So let's see. Yeah, it probably will do it. So yeah, I mean, I am really surprised that I did not dislike this bag. You know, when I first saw this handbag, I was like, yeah, it's not bad. Seriously, it's not bad. Because the color, I would think it's because the color. Yeah. 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 And this handbag, another thing I want to add to is that even though it's a trendy bag, but if people... um not into the luxury handbag or well, um, not into the world. logo mania yeah you probably can't tell this is word. the uh, bottega you know so uh, i still think this handbag because the simplicity style it really can use it for many many years to come because it, it will go with jeans it can go with dress because you know the style is just very sleek very simple well i agree with you but like i said i don't have any of this color handbag so might as well just get one and I really like the puffiness of this. I don't know why I just like it Sarah said the puffiness you, you guys noticed that ever since uh, YSL Saint Laurent came out with this, uh, f uh, the puffy bag and then the Chanel 19 came out with a puffy bag and now it's the 19 the, bag yeah. The night yeah and now it's the Bottega come out with this handbag and what's the formal name of this bag? This is the I believe this is a cassette with the chin okay cassette padded chin. chin okay right. so we're gonna put the uh, dimension on the screen so you know the size of this handbag and i will also link uh, the the website where sarah got it from in the description box the more, I see, like the more i like it. it but one drawback i really don't like is the how you open the handbag because it's such a sweet struggle <laughs> So yeah, that's the only thing. But uh, you yeah, just gotta deal with just it. Just to deal with it. <laughs> wow! So are you surprised that Sierra got this Bottega? And this is your first Bottega bag, no, right? No, no, no. I have another one. Remember in my oh yeah, you have like a uh, the tote. More like a hobo. The like hobo. A hobo, right, yeah. right, right. So well now the second Bottega. the second Bottega and the hobo has a sister now. So wow! Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't smack that like button it's time to smack that like button and if you haven't joined my youtube family please join my youtube family so my family might can grow bigger and bigger. bigger we will bring you even better content in the near future thank you so much and i hope i will see you in my next one bye, bye.